Assalamu alaikum Today we are going to discuss about LCM of polynomial expressions In the previous video we have already discussed and uh, explained about uh, the HCF how to find out the highest common factor using both method factorization and long division You have very well known of uh, the least common multiple in the previous uh, grades that uh, this is the simpler, uh, uh, simplest method how to find out the LCM of the numbers you know that this is a grid form and uh, the prime numbers are utilized and then in the end we multiply find the product and get the answer this is how we obtain the LCM uh, in this today's lesson we are going to uh, solve the LCM using the polynomial expressions this is what I'm going to explain for you today let's see how so here I have written two of the terms this is what we are going to find using the LCM so let's see how to find the LCM of these two terms first of all I'm taking this 39 x raised to the power 7 y raised to the power 3 and z raised to the power 1 so write simply 39 x 7 y cube and z break it up into forms and terms but um, simplify it into different factors so, so 39 is um, 3 times 13 x7 will be x5 and x2 you have to keep this mind that you have to work looking at the second term because we have to in the end compare these two, two terms so this is not other um, in different or apart from this term they are all I mean interconnected so now y cube is and here y6 so y cube I'm going to leave it like this y cube and z can be written as single z okay now next is 91 for 91 I'm going to break it up into uh, 7 times 13 then x5 is remain same x5 y6 can be uh, divided into two portions y3 and y3 then z is uh, 1 and z is 6 after getting it done in the factor forms what we have to do we have to we know that uh, that the LCM is the product of common factor and non common factors this is we have already learned we know that very well that LCM is the product of common factors and non common factors so here similar in the simplest way we are going to mark the common fun first so 13 and 13 here is the common one again this is the common one x5 then uh, y cube gone as common z is common so first of all writing the common ones 13 dot x5 then y cube and z this is the common now multiply with the non-common factor so all the remaining ones are the non-common factors we will write it without any hesitation so 3 7 x2 then x y cube then z6 x square y cube and z6 these are the non-common factors so in in the end what we have to do just to multiply and get the answer so 13 and 3 7 1 13 dot 3 7 the 21 I will write it like directly and uh, x5 and uh, x2 it will be it will be basis same power will be added up let me write it with the darker pen so it will be LCM 13 times 3721 and uh, basis same power will be added up 5 and uh, 2 7 y 3 and 3 plus 6 z 1 plus 6 it will be 7 so 13 times 21 we will do 13 and 21 so it will be 3 1 the 3 3 to the 6 and uh, 1 1 the 1 1 2 the 2 so it will be 3 7 2 so answer will be 2 7 3 x 7 y 6 and z 7
this is the lcm we have obtained from the given two terms right okay so here we are going to discuss about the expression in uh, the second uh, way or second method of finding lcm so here we have got uh, the expressions and previously we were working with terms so let's see how to uh, handle these ki uh, uh, kinds of expressions so x square 25 x plus of 100 we will write we know that very well that in factorization we have many methods to solve the equi our, our expressions here i can see that uh, i can apply the middle term form right easily so here 100 and 1 so we have to get uh, get the product as 100 so i know that 5 times 20 is my 100 5 to the 10 and 0 so if we add this up minus 5 minus 20 we will simply get this 25 with the negative sign so x square minus 5x minus of 20 x plus of 100 or if you want uh, you can write it like this minus uh, 20x minus 5x plus of 100 simply so x x minus 20 minus sign as a common and 5 as a common so x remains same inside without the 5 minus plus minus and 2 times is 100 so write the common fun first and then the remaining factors here i have obtained the answer from the this expression uh, first one equation first done so then the second one is x square minus x minus 20 so here again 21 the 20 and uh, 20 equals to 4 times 5 is 20 so if we do minus 5 plus of 4 we will simply get minus 1 here is the middle term formula solved x square minus 5x plus of 4x minus of 20 so here taking as common x x minus 5 plus 4 x minus 5 x minus 5 is common now x plus 4 these are the roots now here we have understood we have found the factors we know that very well lcm is equals to common factors multiply by non common factors so first of all the common factors are x minus 5 here as well x minus 5 here so i'm going to write x minus 5 common factor x minus 5 non common factor is you know very well x minus 20 and x minus x plus 4 so x minus 20 and x plus 4 this is the non common factor in the end gather them up because this is the they are saying that the product of non common factor and common factors gives you the lcm so simply write lcm equals to x minus 5 x plus 4 and x minus 20 simply this is the answer for the lcm this is how we obtain the lcm of the terms and expressions i hope that you have understood completely and there is no uh, confusion left solving the lcms of the given uh, expressions and the terms if you have any kind of question or query you can leave it in the comment and uh, i will sort it out inshallah ta'ala as usual and uh, we'll meet you inshallah ta'ala in the next lesson in the next video allah hafiz